Hey guys, it's Chris here. I'm back with another video. It's been a while, but I wanted to make sure I got something to you guys. And so today we are going to look at how to import photos directly from your camera into Adobe Lightroom on iPad, and then how to export those photos so you can get them onto an external hard drive or other device. For this tutorial, you're going to need a few things. You're going to need the iPad Pro. Now, you're going to need either the 2018 or 2020 models. Each of those features USB-C, and that's going to be a key piece for getting your files into Lightroom very quickly. You're going to need a USB-C cable that's going to connect between your iPad Pro and your camera. And then you're going to need a camera that supports USB-C. Alternatively, you can use an SD card reader to import from an SD card into an adapter into Lightroom, but this is trying to make the process as seamless as possible without having to get any external readers or adapters. So this is the method that I'm using at the moment. For this tutorial, I will be using the Sony a7R 4 and what I'm gonna be doing is I'm just gonna take a few shots with this, and those shots we're gonna go into Lightroom, and from there I'll show you how everything works. Okay, so now that you've taken your photo and you want to bring it into Lightroom on your iPad, the easiest way is to use a USB-C cable to connect directly from your camera to your iPad. So I'm going to show you how that works right now. On your iPad, go ahead and open Lightroom, just like normal. And on your camera, you're going to open up the door to the USB-C port. Go ahead and plug in one side of the USB-C cable into the iPad and the other into the camera. And then go ahead and turn the camera on. Now it'll pull up this prompt that says, please continue to connect and import the photo. So we're gonna hit continue. And then from there, go ahead and select the photo that you wanna import. And from there, we import it straight off of the camera and into Lightroom. This saves you a step of having to import it to the device first and then into Lightroom or going through another workaround process. So now that all the files are copied, we're gonna go ahead, it gives you a prompt saying that you can disconnect your camera. So go ahead and hit OK. And you go ahead and hit the X button to get out of the import menu. Turn off your camera. You can put that away from now. And we have our photo and it is in Lightroom without having to do any workaround steps. So once we're in Lightroom, the trick is going to be editing and it is going to be exporting that final file. So once you've made all your edits, I'm going to just go ahead and do a quick preset edit here. And we'll just do that. And once you've done all your edits, you're ready to export your final file. What you're gonna do is go ahead and hit the share button. And if you want to share it as just a photo, you could hit export to camera roll. If you want to save it onto a external hard drive, or if you want to save it to the iPad itself, you can export the files but if you're trying to export the original file and back that up somewhere, what you're going to want to do is go ahead and hit export as. It's gonna give you this menu right here, which is going to show a different set of file types. Choose original, hit the check mark, and then that will bring up another prompt. I am going to go ahead and we're going to save that to files. And then from there, pick a location. For me, I have on my iPad a folder where I save all the original files on, from Lightroom that I export. And I can save it there. And that is done. And from there, I can just go to my files folder. And I can either edit my files or I can transfer my files from there. And I'm good to go. So that has been a quick tutorial on how to import files directly into Lightroom and how to export your little files out of Lightroom. I hope this has been super helpful. My name is Chris. If you like videos like this, be sure to hit the like button. To see more videos like this, be sure to hit subscribe. I will see you in the next video. Take care.